everyone, it's me, Claudia. Welcome to Cloud Dolls. For today's video, I'm coming with the little bunny from Delightful. Oh, he's so cute. I know that you saw them in a lot of colors. Rainbow, blue, yellow, pink, with brilliance, everything in space also. But I have to do mine. I'm sorry. I think he's so cute. So, my team for this bunny will be Steampunk. So I pick up everything that I have, like scraps, old metal, including a metal airplane that I have to uh, build for her. Wish me luck. So after seeing the video a thousand times of Delightful, I will put the link below in the description box. It's time to prepare the body. First, I send the body and now I'm gonna making the holes in the legs and arms to put the elastic to make the articulation. This is the elastic that I'm gonna use. It's a really fine elastic because she's really small. Wish me luck. And I'm gonna try it. Okay. Well, not so difficult. Oh, it's getting, it's getting good, it's getting good. Now I'm doing the arms, They're so little. Oh god, I'm afraid. And now. Uh, yeah, I'm pulling it. Oh god. I don't know how to do this. And let me tell you guys, it was awful. <laughs> Here is the final bunny. I put some screws to uh, imitate the steampunk. And uh, yes, with a couple of hours trying it, that's the final result. I think it's cute. I also give him an, a metal eyes, a metal uh, bead that I had from an old necklace. I think it stays good with the team. And now I'm gonna paint her in copper. Airplane. Okay, ready. Instructions. Okay, let's go. First I have to take it, the pieces out of the metal. That's not so difficult. Now I have to put all together. Let me tell you guys, the body. The elastic was more difficult than the airplane. I'm going to use this leather ribbon to secure the airplane to her back better. And it's time to give her some metallic decoration and details. I'm gonna give her a belt also. I'm calling her because she's a she. I name her uh, Victoria from the Victorian time of steampunk. With the rest of the metal, I wanna give her some detail to the face, like a mask and a glasses. First, I sketch in the paper. the mold that I wanted and then I cut it in the metal that is really thin so you can cut it with a scissor and 
and glue it with super glue. Attach it to the face. And now my fingers are attached also to the face. <laughs> and it's super glue all over the place. For the glasses, I cut a little piece of metal and I use a pen to give her a shape. And now I'm gonna use my UV resin and my glow-in-the-dark pigment. I put a little bit of pigment. A little bit more. And now with my UV resin, I drop some... I mix all together, really good, mixed. And then I put them under the UV lamp for 90 seconds. And that's how they look. I just have to trim them around. And glue it to the face. For that, I'm gonna use this piece of leather. I'm gonna glue it directly to the head. I also wanna give her some details with the ribbon. In the Victorian time and in the steampunk style, you see a lot of a combination with a romantic ribbon, metal, old age machinery the two different styles and I really like that. The ribbon that I put in the face, I'm gonna finish them with some brilliance. And now it's time to give her the details. With my white acryl paint, I'm gonna give her a heart in the place of the nose because she's a lady and of course ears also. some flowers I'm gonna paint it the lace also because she lost a little bit of color with the glue I want to push up the white of the lace the hands and of course I'm gonna give her also little heart in her hands and in her foot I'm gonna attach an old close metal uh, chain to the glasses and to the ears. For the hair, I'm gonna use this 100% acryl yarn, white and uh, grey. I'm gonna unfold them and now with my pet brush, I'm gonna brush it. Until you get a smooth hair like this. And now with your hair styler, you're gonna stretch it really good. You get this amazing, brilliant bunny hair. I'm gonna glue it directly to the head. She doesn't come out, come on. Oh. oh, finally. Oh, God. <laughs> Only with me. Only with me. Okay, stop playing, Claudia. And uh, I'll continue with the hair.
I attach it with an elastic and I trim the end of it. And now with my hair straightener and uh, my metal stock, I make the curly. And with this organza, I will give her a lace. To give her more age, I will use my turquoise acryl. Then I'm gonna give it some touches here and there. In the end, with my red acryl, I paint the crosses in the airplane. I wanna thank you guys for all the support that you're giving me. I had a small victory. I have more than 500 subscribers to my YouTube channel. Of course, I work every day to get more and more. If you like my videos, please click on the subscribe button and don't forget to leave your comment, please. And you like it, it's very important for me. Because she's a lady, she needs some eyelashes. I'm gonna use a human eyelashes and it is the final result. She needs a, a little touch of glossy varnish. I finished the high with a, a rhinestone in gold color. I hope you enjoyed my little bunny from Delightful. Thank you Delightful to give me the chance to make this amazing ball joint bunny. It was my first one. I love it. I really love you guys. Don't forget that. I make this to share my love and my passion with everyone because I think that's what the world needs. The world needs more passion, more love more art, more caring, and more respect. That's what I want to give it to all of you. And I, I want to say thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you for all the support that I get from all of you. Thank you. I see you in my next video. Bye.